Look at what they gave us. How do you feel? You know what? They didn't even remove the sticker. But still, it's the thoughts that count. This is so sweet. Coco, stop being a Grinch. I can never. Stop it. So we are at the hook. Grill and lounge, um, TT's before the club. Except we're not going to a club. Coco, where are we going from here? A few moments later. Finally, finally done editing that video. It wasn't a long edit. It wasn't even a complicated edit. This video was really easy and straight to the point. And the video I'm talking about is my shopping video. Like we're going to lunch, we're going shopping. So check that video out. I bought a bunch of body care items. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up at the supermarket, go check that video out. I'm just clearing my kitchen so that I can make some tea for myself. And I don't know if you guys can see, but I've already set up to film another video because people the name of the game here at casa d is consistency and consistency means bulk shooting consistency means always coming up with cool fun interesting ideas that you guys would like i'm checking out a couple of face fat skincare items like i did a whole routine i got a cleanser got serums got the whole shebang but before i do that i want to make myself some tea I'm going to take a shower and I'm basically going to get ready for the day. Today is pretty exciting. We have a couple of great things coming up. I'm actually going to a Women in Gaming Mixer that is happening at Carven. Carven is a gaming center that opened recently. If you love to play video games, if you love to play PC games, they have it all. When I saw the event happening on their profile, I was like, oh my god, I have to be there. As you guys can see, I don't have a gaming system. My dream is to have a decked out PC gaming system so I can play all the PC games I want. But until then, I have actually been thinking about like how can I get my gaming on because I actually want to get back into gaming and then when Carvin opened I was really excited I actually reached out and I asked a couple of questions around pricing and stuff like that so when I saw this happening I was like oh my god perfect amazing yes we're taking a trip to Carvin and then we are going to El Padrino in the evening for an OG's hangout if you've known me you've known El Padrino I have been going to El Padrino to eat for the longest time. They are one of the best restaurants in Lagos. So tonight there's going to be an OG. 
So tonight, there's going to be an OG's party and it's for the original gang, the original group of people that were there from the beginning. Then after that, we're going to Element House. <laughs> this week I'm going into is actually my last week of work. By the time this video comes out, I'm pretty sure I would have announced it anyway, but yes, I am going to be leaving Bamboo. I'm so scared to say where I'm going because like, a part of me is like, yo, I don't jinx it, yo, I don't jinx it, yo, I don't jinx it. I am going to be the digital marketing manager at Maven Records. Ah! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I've said it, I've said it, oh my god, I've said it on camera. Ah! That is my next adventure. I am going to be digital marketing manager at Maven and I am super, super excited when the email came through i was just like oh my god that is my next career adventure and this is actually my last week at bamboo bamboo has been a big part of my life for the past three years and for me to leave was not actually an easy decision like a part of me was like oh my god you're gonna be leaving bamboo i need to make sure i tie up all loose ends and i just basically finish and hand off any projects that are left i was actually part of the process of selecting who was going to take on my role and i realized that i have actually had a huge impact at bamboo if you've been watching my youtube channel from the beginning if you've known me if you know who i am in real life you know how much music means to me music has always been a vehicle and a passion for me to express myself and my emotions always making playlists i have a huge music library whenever i used to do makeup tutorials i always have like sections where i'm singing along to songs i actually used to perform my playlist at danfo i actually got a job making playlists for a streaming service UduX. for me to get to the stage that i am actually going to be marketing music what the fuck it's like a, a, a full it's like a full circle moment this might be my imposter syndrome talking i'm just like i hope i don't fuck it up but i know i'm not gonna fuck it up i know i'm gonna be amazing i know i'm gonna smash it i know i'm gonna be so fucking good Dressed up and ready to head to the Carbon Gaming Center. Hop is from Fashion Nova. The cargo pants are from my cousin's fashion line. And then I'm wearing sneakers that I borrowed from Coco. And then I'm wearing my black fanny pack. This goes everywhere with me.
of the game he's gonna demo for me it's called beat saver beat saber right yeah beat saber. beat saber i want to see what it looks like before i play it because i've never played it before but i've seen it on tiktok it looks fun i've seen it on tiktok before like where they're like slashing things and blocks to music oh they're blocked Oh, okay.
You said we can not. I said we we No, I would love to see you at the end of all these months. So, okay, fair. No, 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 drop off my generator at the gen guy so that he can fix it um, now my Krispy Kreme and I want to get an iced coffee because it's so hot and I need caffeine this iced coffee is about to save my life I don't know if you guys can see how fucking hot it is man I'm back home with my iced coffee and I'm just gonna take a breather I just need to take a couple of seconds to myself it's so fucking hot I'm gonna give myself about 15 minutes then I have to go and get ready for the Marie Claire launch and power brunch I already feel like I'm late but it's okay I'm gonna get there when I get there it's such a hot day my errand lasted much longer than I expected so I just need to you know give myself some grace calm down I'm gonna finish this coffee chill for a little bit under the AC just allow the the waves of coolness to hit me and then go and start getting ready for brunch
fresh on, so, okay? <laughs> mine says, but I don't really know how this works. Double swap, Thank keep you. this card. You can use this card once to force two, two people to drink instead of you. day i am dressed up to go and take a walk and go to the supermarket this is a little set i got from miss k boutique and this shirt is an old shirt from an old brand that i can't remember the name we are going to be walking to the supermarket where we're going to be picking up some household items and also some food items
there is the finished makeup look. But this is the finished look. I think paired with this outfit. I look like I'm ready for business. Thank you very much. I just picked up my breakfast, which is pineapple and ginger juice from food courts. It's a head to the office. Last day at Bamboo Studios. My farewell party got postponed um, because of internet issues. Right now there's like a huge internet downtime because some subsea cables got destroyed or damaged. So I came here to work and to attend the farewell party. But that got postponed because I got kicked out of the meeting. So many people got kicked out like, thank you. Bye. I'm doing some construction work at Battery right behind me. It's gonna be a little bit until Battery is open to the public. Hello everyone, good morning. It is Saturday morning and I am making myself some breakfast. I'm trying to make myself a Spanish omelette with some special baked beans and toasted bread. Light has been somewhat stable. Let's not jinx it. Knock on wood. I've been eating out a lot and i'm really sad about that because my new year's resolution was to eat out less but like this year with the terrible electricity supply we've had it's been very very hard to eat in everything keeps happening at the wrong time but my generator is bad it's so bad when coco was here i think i fixed it like twice and it kept on spoiling i was just done i was honestly just done with the entire thing and that's why i had to actually send it to the mainland to get fixed because the guy that was fixing it here for me on the island was actually fucking ripping me off he would come fix it a little bit and then it would work for a couple of days and then it would just go bad i got tired i actually got tired of fixing my damn generator and now i have somebody else on the mainland who is working on it this weekend is a slow weekend for me i just got out of bed like around 11 i had to go to the pharmacy slash supermarket nearby to buy baked beans and to buy some bread just trying to get all my veggies ready my onion is in the fridge um cooling off this makes it two years since i've moved into this place and i was thinking to myself do i make a video about information things i've learned living on my own still working on what the video will be about per se but i'm thinking it'll be hacks things i've learned security tips the woman's guide to living alone in lagos so i should let me know if you're looking for that as i said with my baked beans i'm making a special baked bean sauce i wanted to have a kind of barbecue sauce so I'm going to be using the ingredients that I have in my fridge to make very quick barbecue sauce, a very fast one. I'm using a little bit of ketchup, a little bit of Worcester sauce, a little bit of red chili sauce. If I had brown sugar, I'd use brown sugar, but I don't. So I'm just going to use like regular sugar in this. This is our quick barbecue sauce or barbecue-esque sauce. Mm -hmm. This this is what i'm going for got two eggs a couple of pinches of salt black pepper and a little garlic powder i'm just gonna mix all the veggies inside and now i'm gonna chop our onion and add it to the egg mm -hmm. our onion is chopped up we're adding it to the egg. This egg is so chunky and I love it. This is how I love my egg. I love it chunky and full. Speaking of cooking, there has been something that I've been thinking about at the back of my mind. I have been thinking of starting all channel memberships on my YouTube channel. And what you get for being a member of my channel is cooking videos. You get YouTube length cooking videos. I want to see if I can get you guys 
to maybe support me a little bit. Being a member of a channel means like you pay a little bit of money. That money will go into supporting me. Things I like to cook are, are a little bit, you know, bougie, a little bit expensive, a little bit different. I am not saying I'm doing it right now. Again, I'm just thinking about it. I'm just mulling it over. This won't affect any other content that I create on my channel or I create anywhere else. Content on my YouTube will remain the same. Everything will basically remain the same. It's just that I now will have a tier of people that just get access to more videos and these videos will actually be cooking videos. Breakfast is ready. We have my eggs with all the bell peppers and onions. Then we have my barbecued baked beans and then we have our toasted bread. Breakfast is ready and I'm very happy. Like I thought of this all morning in bed and now it's here and now I'm very happy. I'm going to eat my breakfast, watch some YouTube, maybe watch some anime. I actually have not watched any anime in a while. I was watching one and it didn't really capture me the way I thought it would capture me, so I kind of fell off. But I think I'm gonna start something new today. I have a lot I need to get through. this potato puree dish um he did some modifications and stuff but it's basically like lasagna but with potatoes instead mm. it's definitely like mashed potatoes yeah. i said mashed potatoes. it's definitely like lasagna mm -hmm. put a crust of mozzarella cheese on top and it's so good mm. Swaps. Happy Beyonce Day to everyone that celebrates. As I am recording this, it is the 29th of March, which means we got a new Beyonce album. We got country album, and I have listened to it, and I love it so much to the album that I love the musicality, the collaborations, the features. The Miley Cyrus song is so good. Oh, I love the fact that I stand such a talented woman. Like. 
I only stand the best place. I am currently in a really good place right now. I'm in a good mood. It has officially been my first week of work at Maven. It's been amazing so far and like I'm already gearing up to like loving it and like really enjoying the role and enjoying the parts I'm going to be playing. That is it for today's video and it for today's vlog. Thank you guys so so much for watching. Please not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Oh my god. Really? It just took out. Oh well. Please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can join my family here on YouTube. Also, do not forget. Oh my god, I'm already sweating. Fucking hell. Do not forget to click on the notification bell so that you will always get a notification whenever I upload a new video. And also, do not forget to click on the like button so that you can show YouTube that this video is awesome and you should recommend it to other people as well. Do not forget to be awesome, and I'll see you guys in my next video where hopefully light situation isn't like this. Bye.